Hello everyone, welcome all of you in today's video session. We are going to discuss a very important question of microeconomics, economics 103. This video session is being recorded for the SCT College, United Arab Emirates. So this one is a very popular question of uh, microeconomics. Uh, in the upper part, we have been given uh, many details like a woman is selling some home ketchup and then all the details are given and there are two sub parts of this question. First one is asking for the accounting profit and second one is asking for the economic profit. So for the time being, uh, just forget about the upper part. Uh, we are concerned only with the uh, below two parts. In this question, we need to calculate accounting profit and economic profit. Before we calculate, we need to understand two concepts that are the explicit cost and implicit cost. Okay, so I will tell you what is the explicit cost and what is the implicit cost. Suppose you are doing a job and you are in the job and your monthly salary is 500 per month okay but now you have decided that you will quit your job and you will study in a college so the fees of your college is 800 per month okay so uh, suppose if someone asks you what is the fees of your college so you will tell the uh, my uh, my fees of my college is eight hundred dollar per month. So this is the explicit cost. Mean the cost which is being borne by the uh, any producer uh, for using any service. Okay. So this is the explicit cost. But now again the question comes what is the implicit cost. Okay. So uh, first you were in the job and you were getting a salary of 500 per month. Now you are in a college and you are paying fees to the college. Okay. So in order to study in a college you quit your job. Okay. Earlier you were getting 500 salary per month. Now you are paying college 800. So you are giving the college 800 per month from your pocket and now you are not getting any salary because you have already stopped working so your implicit cost will be explicit cost plus the profit you have foregone foregone means the profit which you are not taking suppose now you are a student you have no salary you are giving 800 dollar from your pocket okay so your profit you have foregone is 500 dollar per month so your implicit cost will be 800 dollar plus 500 dollar that will be the 1300 dollar suppose you are not a student then you will earn 500 dollar per month but now you are a student you are paying a fees uh, for your education 800 per dollar per month and you are not in job so you are not getting any salary so you are not getting any salary it is a loss for you okay first thing what you are doing is you are paying fees and second thing is that you are not getting any salary so this is the implicit cost so accounting profit and economic profit these are the two formulas you can memorize them and uh, in the next slides i will explain them more clearly so this is the accounting profit accounting profit is equal to total revenue minus the explicit cost this is the formula for the accounting profit and economic profit is equal to the total revenue minus the explicit cost uh, plus implicit cost uh, in the next slides i will uh, uh, explain the explicit cost and implicit cost in more detail you will understand more now this is the question back to the question this is our uh, original question in it, it is saying that there is a woman, her name is Linda and she is selling 100 bottles of homemade ketchup and the price of per bottle is 10 dollar. 
the cost of ingredients the bottle and the label was 700 okay and it took her 20 hours to make the ketchup and do so she took off uh, basically it is saying that there is a woman her name is linda and she is already doing job somewhere but she uh, uh, she took time off means she did not go uh, did not uh, go to that job but she decided that uh, i will now make ketchup and she make 100 bottles and she is selling 10 dollar for one bottle okay and the linda is already doing job somewhere and her salary is 20 dollar per hour it is her salary means suppose she is doing job somewhere and they are giving her a salary of 20 dollar per hour and to uh, manufacture or to produce all these ketchup she needs 20 hours mean uh, it it take it uh, took her 20 hours to uh, create or to manufacture 100 bottles of the homemade ketchup okay so this now uh, i am explaining this by the figure so the total bottle are 100 she is manufacturing or she is producing 100 bottles and each bottle is 10 dollar price okay so 100 bottles of the ketchup and every bottle is for the 10 dollars okay so price per bottle is 10 dollar now what will be the total revenue total revenue is the selling price into the quantity sold so the total uh, uh, the total bottles are 100 and the selling price is 10 so we will uh, do it 100 into 10 that will be the 1000 so 1000 is the total revenue okay why we are calculating the total revenue because if we want to uh, calculate the accounting profit we need the total revenue explicit cost and if you want to calculate the economic profit then we need to calculate the total revenue minus explicit cost and implicit cost all right so this is now in the question it has been given that the price of the ingredients the bottle and the label was 700 so uh, if she wants to make ketchup then she need the tomatoes and other spices and uh, salt these raw material and uh, if, if she want to pack the ketchup in the bottle then she need the empty bottles okay and uh, the labeling labeling means she put her name over the bottle so all these things are at 700 dollar okay 700 dollar now you can see that uh, this has been given in the question that uh, the price of the raw material bottles and the label is the 700 so 700 is the explicit cost okay c is manufacturing 100 bottles okay so for the 100 bottles c is taking a price of 10 dollar per bottle so total revenue is 100 uh, 1000 dollar and the explicit cost mean she needs the tomatoes other raw material empty bottle hallmark labeling all these are the 700 dollars so this is the explicit cost mean this is the input cost this is the manufacturing cost for the her and we will call it the explicit call explicit mean that something that is clearly visible this price is clearly visible to us that she is using the raw material bottles and this is the uh, explicit cost now we will talk about and one more important thing that is the implicit cost in the question it has been given uh, you will notice here that uh, she is already doing job somewhere and they are giving her the salary of 20 dollars per hour okay so uh, this is her salary she is doing job and this is her salary but now she is deciding that no today i will not go to the job but i will make the ketchup and in the ketchup making it takes 20, uh, 20 hours she, she makes 100 bottles and in order to make these 100 bottles it takes 20 hours means she spend 20 hours time to make 100 ketchup bottle suppose uh, she go to her job and she work for the 20 hours how much money she will make she will make 20 into 20 mean the 400 dollars okay 
now it is linda's choice she decided that today i will not go to the job and i will make the catch up and the catch up make uh, the catch up making take her 20 hours now now we are discussing about the implicit cost what is the implicit cost linda suppose linda is going to the job uh, she decide that no i will not make the tomato ketchup and i will go back to the my job so in those 20 hours she can earn 400 dollars but she decided today i will not go to the job and i will make catch up so it took her 20 hours in those 20 hours she could have earned 400 dollars from her job so she did not get this 400 dollar because she did not go to job she decided that today i will miss my job and i will make the catch up so catch up making total was the 20 hours so suppose she was doing the job for 20 hours then implicit cost will be the 20 into 20 is equal to the 400 so this is the implicit cost so explicit cost what was the explicit uh, cost it was the uh, price of raw material bottle and all these things these were the explicit cost and implicit cost is the profit foregone foregone means you have forget Uh, forget means forgone means basically means uh, let it go forget about it so the implicit cost is the 400 now if we use the formula then for the accounting profit the total revenue minus the explicit cost so total revenue we have find out that uh, price of one bottle was the 100 uh, 10 dollar and the total were the 100 so it will be the 100 into 10 the 1000 and explicit we have calculated and it was already given in the question that uh, the explicit cost is the 700 means explicit cost uh, in the question is given the price of ingredient bottle and the label explicit basically means the that, that uh, price which you can see which you can clearly notice okay so this uh, explicit price we can clearly notice but uh, implicit price we cannot notice clearly okay so this is the formula for the accounting profit and now for the uh, formula for the economic profit is uh, equal to the total revenue minus then the, this is the bracket explicit cost plus implicit cost so the total revenue was the uh 1000 minus 700 plus 400 700 is the explicit cost and 400 is the implicit cost so it will become uh, $100 minus 1100 so ultimately it comes out minus 1100 minus minus means linda is making a loss linda decided that today i will not go to the job but i will make catch up and sell it so the overall profit for the linda is in minus it means that the decision of linda is not good she should not make catch up rather she should go to the job and do her job because in 20 hours she can earn 400 dollars but in the catch up manufacturing she will be able to earn only 300 so the decision of linda is not good because the economic profit is minus 100 dollar so this is how uh, i have tried to explain this question i hope every one of you will be able to understand in case any doubt live classes project help you can contact me on this whatsapp number Thank you so much for watching the video. Have a nice day. Hello everyone, welcome all of you.